Residents across Hampton Roads are getting a cold dose of hurricane costs. Hurricane deductibles, often called cyclone deductibles on insurance policies, are kicking in, and it's costing many of you thousands of dollars. Standing your side's Andy Fox is here now with how hurricane policies kick in when trouble's on the way, Andy. Tommy and Nicole, read the fine print right here. The hurricane clause of your insurance policy kicks in when the National Weather Service, listen to this, issues a hurricane watch and then warning. When that happens, higher deductibles kick in, costing you policyholders thousands more than your regular deductible. It's unbelievable. It's like they got you no matter which way you go. You could say Tom Lupton's stuck. Irene took down the tree and took down the family pool. This is a pool. This is a luxury. This right. is not the roof on your house. That's right. Do you replace it? You can't afford it. That's it. I cannot afford it. Lupton says he cannot afford to pay the deductible to fix the pool. Like thousands of Hampton Roads residents, he has hurricane coverage, but his is very high at 5%. So Lupton has dwelling protection of $164,000 on his home. His hurricane deductible is 5% of that, or $8,200. Most have 2%. If that were the case, Lupton would only owe $3,280. Even 1% is more common than his 5%, Lupton would owe $1,640. Lupton feels real bad right now, and he doesn't trust the insurance adjuster. He told me to go ahead, if I wanted to move it, to go ahead and move it and just make sure I took pictures of it. And I said, no, sir. Nothing is going to be moved until someone comes out here and looks at it. Because just as sure as you've done it, you're not going to have the right pictures. They can't afford the deductible for us to come in and finish off, do any of the work. Lupton is not alone. Contractor Steve Salas sees it all over Hampton Roads. We can't work for free, and naturally, they don't want us to work for free. That's what we're hearing all, all over the area. For now, Tom Lupton is a man without a pool, and a man who may not have a pool in the future, thanks to Hurricane Irene and a high deductible. No, I can't pay it. No, I cannot pay it. Now, Lupton is still waiting for the insurance adjuster to come to his home. He's already about a day late. In the meantime, nothing will move until the adjuster gets there. And that's a good 10 on your side tip. Don't move anything. Tonight at 6, we talk to a local independent insurance agent who signs policies with many companies. She has a 10 on your side tip that could save you thousands of dollars. That tonight at 6. And, of course, the problem is we don't worry about the hurricane policy until... There's a hurricane, There's a hurricane. hits. And then when that happens, then you're saying, oh, I didn't know this, yeah. I didn't know this. So know well, it's in the policy before and have money set aside if you can. And the interesting thing is 74 miles per hour. Tonight at 6, why that is an important number with one insurance company. All right, All right. we'll see you then. Thanks, Andy. Okay.